Well, we're talking about the late 19th century, and primarily we're talking about the Russian-Ottoman War of 1877-78 and the Congress of Berlin, which followed. And that war almost brought Russia and Britain into um, conflict, open conflict. So at the Congress of Berlin, uh, the main, one of the main um, goals of the British was to prevent a similar situation arising in Eastern Anatolia that had arisen in the Balkans. And so Russia was seen by Britain as having stirred up the Christians of the Balkans into revolt, which Russia then used as a pretext for attack. And so Britain, through the Congress of Berlin, tried to set up conditions which would prevent Russia from having any opportunity to do the same in Eastern Anatolia. All right. So after the Congress of 1878, the British put forward a reform plan. Now the central idea of the reform plan was to put British officials on the ground in Eastern Anatolia, to put them there as um, tax inspectors, to put them there as prison inspectors, so forth and so on. And that would give them a presence in Eastern Anatolia. They could watch the Russians and they could therefore help the Armenians. That was their view to kind of upgrade their status. And that's more or less how it was packaged to the British public. We're doing things for the Armenians. But the central motive, of course, was Britain's imperial ambitions and to deflect the Russians from causing trouble in Eastern Anatolia.